Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to part 5 of Spider-Man 2. Uh, right now we are just about to go over to the lab of some sorts that Harry opened up and we are going to go check that out. Uh, I also just got a call from Chief Clark about a demolition building not being able to be demoed because of some hooligans that we need to take care of so maybe we'll get back to that. Shouldn't you guys be in an hourglass or something? Gotta get that sand crystal. Clear now. You're circling me, Mia. Oh, wishing I just stayed home with you, came here. Helped you with your homework. Made you the one meal that I know how to cook. But it's too late now. Kimia is Marco's daughter. How did I not know he was a dad? Just check back in on Marco. He's steadily improving. Making more and more sense. He's even eating again. Doctors are hopeful. Good work. Emily May Foundation. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Emily's tree. Oh, this is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this, but my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? <coughs> <coughs> It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. It's pretty amazing yeah, for a lot. He lab. hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But <laughs> I was gonna give him a tour. Let him aside for himself all right you know seeing you boys together again <laughs> right then have fun get your badge out let's go exploring So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... You got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. This is crazy. Yes, Chief. I just checked in on Nana Nanny. Has all done great. Not with the well, I learned to do in the last class. 
Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. It's so nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day Whoa. comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Hey, now the controller. Attention. Whoa, Bobby. This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wolves. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting them, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Hear that, little bee wolves? You still get to pollinate another day, too. You're not gonna mess with my bees. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. <laughs> we got great data. Okay, flying home. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. <laughs> I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. I got organs. Damn. Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance Dr. again? Dr. Connors. It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is mm. the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Sweet, let's explore. So that was crazy. <laughs> but it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Come on. Guess I'll look around.
Hmm, I wonder what rock. Yeah. Uh, I just want to work. focus on me mission. The Brooklyn Vision stuff can wait, and most of it I can just do on my own time and show you guys like the final emphasis of like the last missions kind of thing. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project, and lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. Hey, it's me. Welcome to Adam Cole. Can you see if you let B be the base of the member system and end the degree of need to be extracted? Mm -hmm. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look this at way, it that dude. way. This way, dude. Got it. Mm hmm Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak the plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That will be a plant that can feed the world. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. 
I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. Make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. to tell you some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city if you have time check them out i've sent you the locations and your badge will grant you access all right i'll swing by Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. Uh, but I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but... duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Claim, and then we'll continue on with the story mode. For the main story. I 
there's also a crystal here. Hey, what's up? You can hear me, Marco. Not interested in a puppet show. I'm trying to help here. I did the wrong thing. That was a close one. Now, where's that sand crystal? I ask them what they want, and all they say is. The beast inside me. But that ain't been me for a long time. Just like I promised you. He promised his daughter. That's what... We haven't seen Sandman in so long. He gave it up to her. Sorry, MJ. You've got my full attention now. Go ahead. Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Beast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May's stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... everything. I'll call him right now. But... don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Spider-Man, over here! We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open, and make sure nobody touches that detonator. <laughs> Spiderbot can search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud. Hey, Spiderbot. A really cool one. Better one. All right. I find the people, Clark gets them out. Is anyone out there? Help! Is that a robot? Hey, it's Spider-Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue, so they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider-Man. Thank you. Hey, Clark. Did you get the location I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Spider-Man's... Ah! <sighs> I mean... Whoa. Just try not to move. They'll have you out of here soon. Okay. 
Thank you, Spider-Man. Looks like I need to go up. So it's field testing time for my latest upgrade. Shit. Hey, Clark, did you get the last location I sent your way? Heading there now. There's only one other worker left inside. Hurry, Spider-Man. Leave it to me. Send a new location your way. But this guy said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? You're not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on it. in the flame i just i just wanted out then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in painfully Eternal. 
crazy. Thanks. So what's your deal? There you are. Hey! You never did like my smoking. Yuri. Well, let's go your race. Fits pretty well, I think. I tried. Where have you been? No time. What about them? They made their choice. This will be a new record. And they said it couldn't be done. Looks like Yuri took off. I thought she'd just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith? I should keep an eye on her. And the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. <clears throat> okay, now we'll get on to this. See any bad guys? Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge, but there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh, man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Glittering? Come on, man. Hmm. <laughs> In the water you go. Should take a look around. Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, birdie. Take 
take me to your nest. Gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old. Getting to do real science, though, for actual money. Oh my <laughs> god, I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Whoa, is that a real gun? That actually works? Hope you have renter's insurance. Take a look under the <coughs> Damn. I'll take that as a no. You are psycho. Well, that's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. Now, where's your boss? Oh. Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh. Is that your home? Come on, Birdie, let go! Come on! Not buy a ticket for this ride! Good thing we got web wings. Gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ. This might be a long episode. Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. <coughs> There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just... vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. I need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta draw one of them away. Heard something. That's one. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. That's a lot of gear. It's like they're prepping for war.
weird how they made a uh, jungle in a city. Oh, I didn't see you. I tracked poachers for the parks, but when I'd find them, I was harsher than my bosses would have preferred. Idiots. There we go. Where'd you go? video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Genki, but he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Yes, it's loaded. What do I need to do? Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. Want some hunger? You hungry too? You're feeling sleep. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Oh, oh sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking fields operational. Good. Beetles, talon drones, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still missing some shipments. I'll have to pay that yardmaster a visit. But otherwise. What the? What is going on with my game? What's this? Jesus. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Thank God it was right there. Remaining blind secured. Swear to God, if he starts doing a little tightrope fucking duo thing again. Thank God. Raven guy must be rich or well connected. Both. Down you go. Fair enough. But I did not expect Craven to care so much about plants. I've seen him walk a hunter back from the brink of death with what he carries in his pouches. He doesn't restrict himself with the straight jacket of modern medicine that explains a lot what do you mean no man can have a brain like you focus he knows nothing but the hunt perhaps if you focus more on yourself instead of others creating a web <laughs> Come on. Oh, Jesus. Old superpower gang. 
Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Aunt Meg was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. Craven studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from. Or how to get them for himself. That's... the Tiara Apitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some... pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison. But couldn't afford the flights to... Riotea? Guess Craven could. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal... Ugh. Dr. Farley Stillwell? His genetic experiments gave Scorpion his abilities. Craven sure does his research. their weapons on that armor Whoa. and not a single scratch almost an exact replica must have been probing it for weaknesses can never be too careful with scorpion wait a sec Looks like Craven is doing more than just hunting. I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. How about this? The main Craven wears. Know the story behind it? Didn't know there was one. There was some mine outside Sap. C'était quoi? C'est bruit. Half time. How many more fires will be light? My eyes do not deceive me. Oh, come on. You guys need to keep your mouth shut. You didn't even get to web blind anyone that much.
I could really use some answers instead of questions right now. That looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. Never gonna win best in show with that attitude. So I guess Spider-Man figured out it's going for everyone. Nice doggy kitty robot. <laughs> Those teeth are no joke. Craven guy's putting together quite the team. Let's use the antidote. Is 
Is this the best you can do? <laughs> They fucking killed Scorpion. Of course, I already knew that, and I still fucking hate watching this. <sighs> He's not teaming up with supervillains for some hunt. There is prey. Felicia. It's almost here, and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. <sighs> Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. I see you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? Uh, I'm sorry. Look, next time, I promise. Miles. I love you. I'm just going to see that he wasn't doing anything homework like. found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion, and he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? I don't know, but this list is extensive. These must be the people Marco warned us about. They were hunting Sandman. No way. And Felicia's on their list, too. Black Hat? Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up and... We're going to find Lee, Miles. I promise. <sighs> Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Well, I'll leave this Maybe episode here. Some yes, motherfucker. I'll leave this episode here. If you guys enjoyed this, maybe think of subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.